Well lads, what's the crack? My name is RJ Runner and welcome to Dead Rising. Now, I did start a Let's Play series on this on this game on my channel going back, I think it was last year, the year before. I think it was the PS4 version I was playing though at the time. Uh, either way, I quit it, I didn't keep up with it, I stopped it completely and I deleted it from my channel entirely. I don't know why, I think I got a little bit bored of it. Uh, maybe I just wasn't as confident as I was, or as I am now than I was back then but seeing as it's October I decided you know what it's a horror game it's a zombie game I'm gonna play it I'm gonna finish it from start <laughs> uh, I'm not the most articulate of guys um, I'm gonna play it from start to finish is what I meant to say so either way let's get right into it and one thing I'm gonna do is anytime there's a cutscene I'm just gonna make my uh, face cam webcam vanish just go whoosh just so you can get the full experience. Okay, so let's start game and get right into it. Alright, so this is a little quickie tutorial on how to use the camera here. So, um, oh, here, here it is. Right stick to move camera, X to shutter, B to zoom in, and A to zoom out. Okay, so X, I mean, X they mean is probably to take a photo, from what I remember. But I'm not going to waste my shots, so I'll just wait for a decent one. Oh, this looks like a good one. Ah, uh, far from. He looks like he's about to get nommed on by zombies. Uh, just gotta turn down the volume of my headset a wee bit, because I can barely hear myself talk. Okay, that's... That's better. That's better. Oh, crap. I miss his face. Freaking lamppost. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Sure is. Oh, and down he goes, down he goes. Oh, oh, God. A swing and a miss. I mean, if that was me, I would have had half their fucking heads bashed in at this age. Come on, man. Oh, drama, drama, do you see that? Drama, drama on YouTube. Oh, God, oh, the drama, oh, the drama, oh, God. Here's... Where? With the bus? Oh, okay. Now, speaking of drama, um, it's kind of funny. The people who, who suddenly hate drama channels are the ones who've been caught up in drama. They're the ones who are on the receiving end of it. Basically, they don't like to be held accountable for whatever shitty shit they've done or are currently doing. Because these are the people who laugh at other people's misfortunes. They laugh at other people being kicked off the platform. But uh, when stuff has been dragged out about uh, dragged up about them from their past or uh, some nasty stuff that they've done and really haven't really apologized or acknowledged or yeah, acknowledged it. Suddenly they hate drama channels. They hate them. They think that they should be booted off YouTube because they don't want to be held accountable. <gasps> oh! Almost missed that. I did indeed, and I got a lot of PP points from it. Uh, speaking of PP, uh, the PPs, I'm not sure what the PP stands for, but it basically is um, our experience, more or less. So the more PP points we get, uh, the more health we get, the more inventory spaces we get. And we can unlock cool moves and stuff like that, as far as I remember. So yeah, PP points will be essential. And also we have to find survivors, fight against psychopaths. All of those will contribute towards our PP points. We get PP points from, from uh, killing zombies as well, stuff like that. But, I'm not going to be killing a, a shit ton of zombies, probably because... Um, we have 72 hours to find out what the hell is going on here. And that's uh, not a lot of in-game time. I mean, it, it's a small bit. It is and, and it isn't, but you have to sort of um, manage your time well. Oh, she's got to go now. She's, she's, she means business. Oh, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. Come on, lady, just run past him. Run past him. You can do it. And she just horses the gun at the zombie. Nothing else to, nothing else to save her now. Oh, hi. Sorry, can't save you. Oh, 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 and down she goes. Oh, awesome. Oh, and there's the splat. Can I get more PP points? Oh, no, no, no. Ah. Oh. I want to see the center of town. Take me there. Gotta like that motion blur. Give me 
on the rooftop of that mall? You gotta be kidding me. Man, you are nuts. All right, listen. Don't forget to come back for me. As long as you're not dead, Fred. It's Frank. Frank West. Remember that name, because the whole world's gonna know it in three days when I get the scoop. down to that rooftop. Reporter, aren't you? Yeah. Uh, you came alone. Yeah, I'm freelance. You know, going the battlefield alone, no crew. So, uh, what's going on around here anyway? You came by helicopter, didn't you? What did you see from the sky? Well. If it were just a riot, I doubt the military would quarantine the entire area. The moratorium on information getting out is a little extreme, in my opinion. There's, uh, something else I can't put my finger on. Doesn't sound like civil disobedience. It's too quiet. <laughs> Almost as if everyone's already dead. Yeah. So why don't you just tell me already? What's going on? I think you'd better see for yourself. This, my friend, is hell. Alright, Frank must be on the heliport at 12pm on the 22nd or he will be left behind in the mall. Pay careful attention to the time as you play again. This is very important, especially when it comes down to rescuing survivors, battling against psychopaths, all that. So time is of the essence. Essence, we must, I must have good time management skills. Um, I'm, I mean, if I'm to transfer that from my time management skills in real life to game, then... Uh, I am screwed. Uh, either way, let's not worry about that. By the way, I always thought this part was cool, where the way we could look at our watch. Because I initially played this on the Xbox 360 when it first came out. I actually got this game second hand, but unfortunately, it was uh, scratched. So when I got to a certain point in the game, the game would freeze. I couldn't get past. So, a eh, little bummed out, but I. I got a new copy on, on the house from GameStop because GameStop were cool about it. I like going to GameStop. People there are nice. Okay, Carlito, my friend, got anything else to say? Looks like you're the only journalist that made it out here. I'm looking forward to some nice pictures. <laughs> okay, how about I take a picture of you? Oh, give me a smile. Stop pouting. Give me a smile. No? No smile? Oh, all right. Whatever. All right. Okay, cool. Um. Um. One thing I'm just after noticing. <laughs> I'm at level twenty already. Uh. This can't be right. How am I at level twenty? What the hell? 
Um. Oh, I know. I. Uh. Okay. Um. I had a previous save game from this. I'm not sure how long ago it was. Uh. Because I'm playing, I'm playing this on Steam. I have this on Steam as well. I initially played this on PS4, but I think going back maybe a few months ago as well, I started playing it again in my own free time. Oh, uh, yikes! I don't want to be a bit of a liar here, but uh, I did play it re recently enough. But recently enough uh, was maybe about a few month, a few months ago. I think it was uh, during the COVID lockdown. I'm not sure. I forget. Um, Damn, because I feel like this is almost cheating in a way. Okay, we're back. We're back. We're back. I, I know what happened. I know what happened. See, you have different save slots. I'm not sure what way that works, but when I changed my save slot, uh, it just brought me, brought me back here as if I'm playing a new. Well, I am playing a new. That's the way I want to play. I want to play it like I'm starting the game afresh. Okay. Okay, we know how, know what to save. Uh, we can save here, so I'll just uh, do that. I mean, that helicopter ride took a lot out of Frankie Boy there. Okay, so let's get to some zombie killing. Which way do we go? Ah, this way. Because these are empty rooms. These are where the survivors stay, more or less. And this is... God knows what's going on there. We can look at the uh, cameras. What in the world? All right, that, that, that was cool. Oh, we can change clothes. Yeah. Oh, yes, this was the set of clothes I started off with. Well, that I started the video with. I'm going to keep these on me. I think these are uh, very snazzy, very uh, snappy. And this is where all hell breaks loose. Well, not just yet, but in two minutes, in five minutes, roughly speaking. But you got to be recording for, what, 17 minutes now? Holy hell. Those cutscenes could be that long, could they? No. This is no time to ogle pretty girls, son. You looking to get yourself eaten alive by zombies? What? Did you just say zombies? Take a look out there. If those ain't zombies, what would you call them? There's been more and more of them since last night. Now... They're all that's out there. Eh, look on the bright side. Zombies are stupid and slow. <laughs> we should be safe in here. All right, then. Feel like making yourself useful? Take a look around the mall. Bring anything we can use for the barricade back here. On the lake. Come on, pronto. Okay, what's your name, Ryan? I think there's something wrong with your eyeballs. I saw them popping out from a mile away. Well, 
again, Mr. Articulate here, what I meant to say was, it was almost like that they were popping out a mile from your freaking skull. Now hold still. Oh, Lord, that was a lot of P-Poy, p p p p points. p poy says I. Okay, okay, well, whatever, Ryan, keep your pants on. Keep your orthopedics in check. Oh, I didn't realize this now. So the, ho the higher the percentage here, the more... The more PP points you get, okay. Boom. Perfect. Oh, there's a PP sticker as well. Oh, so some stores have uh, these stickers. I didn't even realize that. That's cool, so... Uh, wait. Where was that sticker? Just want to check that out one last time. No, and I don't care about your darling Madonna. Oh, and speaking of which, the coolest thing I thought about this game, and the coolest thing that really impressed me, or what really impressed me about this game, God damn it, I am so inarticulate today. Then again, that's the same every day. Uh, the water fix, I mean, it didn't look like this exactly on the Xbox 360, but the splashing and stuff like that was pretty cool for its time, because this is on PC, I'm playing on a pretty high-end machine, so everything is on mech settings, so it looks even better than the original, so. It's like you see all the reflections here, well, not all the reflections, but but a majority of the reflections. I mean, it, it looks good. For a game that's about what? Um, it came out in 2006, 2007, I think, roughly. For a game that's either about 13 or 14 years old, it still holds up. Because this... Uh, I don't think this is the remastered version. This is just the old uh, regular Steam version. Okay, so I'm just going to snap a few pictures, you know, build up those uh, PP points. Boom. Oh, more drama. Lovely. Because everyone loves a bit of drama. Again, except for the people that are involved in it. Wait, Mark. Is that your name, Mark? No way! No way! You have the face of Mark Zuckerberg. <laughs> you are Mark Zuckerberg. Oh, this guy is definitely going to get killed. Oh, you're not scared. Oh, buddy, you will be. I mean, look at that robotic face. He looks the head of Mark Zuckerberg. Look at him. Lifeless. Oh, my God. That is awesome. Was that intentional, Microsoft? Or Capcom, sorry? Did you include Mark, uh, did you include uh, Sucky, Mark Suckyberg intentionally? Oh, oh, speaking of drama. Oh my god, don't you love it? Drama. Okay, so what what do we have? Yeah, we have to get oh, cutscene time I guess.
Okay, you heard the man. We gotta move. Oh, oh! I didn't mean to pick this up. Go on, Alan. You teach those zombies a thing or two. Oh, Brian is dead. Everyone's dying. Get away! Oh, we got snacks. Uh, but what I want to do is I want to pick up some melee weapons. We got a baseball bat. We got another baseball bat. And we got another two by four. Okay. All right, Alan. I'll see you later. Oh, and down he goes. And of, and of course, uh, you know, the AI, the AI here, they're not going to do a damn thing. Oh, there goes Catty. Get back, get back, get back. Oh, hold on, hold on. Was that a shotgun? Was that a freaking shotgun I saw? I'm not sure what type of gun it was, but it was definitely a gun. I want it, I need it, I'm getting it. Back off! Oh god, oh god, I'm getting numbed on. No, please, leave me alone, get back! I need that shotgun, I need it, 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 I want it! Back! Oh my god, move! Oh jeez, oh, oh! Wait, is, is this zombie Kathy? How the hell did she get down here so fast? Get off! Oh, and down they go. Come on, batter up! Oh, that was nice! Oh, here's a shotgun. Here it is. Give me that. You know, I'm running. I'm keeping this. I might need it. I might need it. In fact, you know what? I definitely will need it because at some point, get out of my way. I'm going to be facing off against convicts in an armed in an armed car and in an armored jeep. Sorry, armored jeep is what I'll be facing them off against. Facing facing them off against. Yes, something like that. What, whatever. And I skipped a cutscene. God damn it. Oh, well, um, yeah, I got a bit flustered there with my words. Either way, what I meant to say was, at some point, I will be needing the shotgun to dispatch of some convicts riding around in a jeep with a mounted machine gun, is what I was trying to get out. God damn it. Again, not very articulate these days. Don't know why. Um, right. Oh, hey, J Jesse, how you doing? Okay, I've missed a very important cutscene that basically explains what her purpose is here. Just explains uh, the story behind her character. But either way, she is like a special agent working for Homeland Security, as far as I know. Uh, right, I'm gonna, I want to be a full health, so I'll just take this, even though it's a bit of a waste. And uh, I'll take another one. I'll take, uh, yeah, that. So where do I have to be? Where do I have to go? Oh, I think I have to um, go after what's his name? What is you ain't planning on going back down to Ah god damn it I miss it. Well if you're gonna go at least take this transceiver with you and you better take this map too. I don't need no goddamn map. Okay, so this is... Hey, anybody around? Oh, there's a guy named Jeff. So, we'll be using this vent here to get in and out of the mall. We won't be going in the same way we, ca we came out. Or we won't be coming out the same way we came in. Ah! We won't be going out. We won't be coming back the same way we came into the mall, in other words. No, I haven't seen your wife, but you can come with me. Come here. She's around this corner, as far as I know. Name's Jeff Meyer, by the way. Okay, Jeff, come on. Let me get your photo. Good. Oh, 100 PP points, not bad. Oh, okay, okay. Just basically a tutorial on how to escort survivors. Oh, here's your wife. I assume she's your wife. I mean, you're both big and burly. You kind of look the same, I think, from a distance. Let me get a photo. <gasps> oh, PP points. 6,000 PP points. Perfect. 
Oh my god, I'm almost to level two. Okay, awesome. Come on, come on. Let's go. Come on, one more photo. Smile. Smile for the camera. Perfect. Okay, not a lot of PP points, but uh oh, it got me to level two anyway. Yeah. Okay, so I have a new skill master. What skill did I master? Okay, so leveling up can increase your attack, speed, livestock, and throw. Okay, that's awesome. Oh, zombie ride. Oh, I know what the zombie ride is. Basically, I can hop up on top of um, zombies. That's more or less just... Come on. Get your fat ass up here. Did you just sort of Mario jump up on that uh, platform there? Okay, that was weird. I'm never going to the mall again as long as they... Whatever, I don't, I, I don't care. Oh, and we're also at level 3. Awesome, so the more survivors we escort at one time, the higher yeah. the PP points we get. Oh, and I, I can hold more items now. Cool. That's going to be um, very pertinent to my uh, survival. Because the more items I can hold, uh, the better. So I can hold a combination of food items and weapon items. So, oh my god, I forgot about this guy, Otis. He is going to be harassing me a lot. Sneak up on me. <sighs> Brad was attacked. I located him on the monitor. Ugh. It's probably just a sprain. I've got to help Brad. Or he's done for. All right, fine. Give me your gun. Come on. I'm the reason you just got hurt. Let me help. No, I can't let a civilian do that. That's against regulations. Yeah, well, I don't think they had zombie-infested malls in mind when they wrote those regulations, kid. You know how to use this? Kinda. I've covered wars, you know. Look, after I'm through helping you, you and I are gonna have a nice little chat. Alright, so we've got to save Brad. Brad was the black guy who started yelling us from atop the balcony or the freaking thingamabob at the start of the game. Oh, don't kill... Oh my god, yeah. See, this is going to be a recurring thing. So if I happen to get attacked by a zombie or uh, I happen to drop Otis's call, he's going to keep freaking harassing me. Okay, whatever. I don't, I, I, I don't care. Otis, I know how malls work. Okay, so I'm just going to do a little bit of exploring. Again, I know time is kind of off the essence here, but just want to see what I can gather here. Okay, there's not a lot of zombos, so I should be good. I can just run past them. So, what do we have up here? Sports shop, clothes shops. Ooh, I can get me some new duds up here. Uh, can I? Oh, I can get a handbag. Uh, I don't have enough room for a handbag. I'll probably have to drop one item for it. Hmm. Blue isn't really my color, but I do say it makes me look fabulous. But, seriously. Don't need it. I mean, I can bash zombies all, days, uh, all day with it, but... Don't think I'll be getting anywhere. Are you a psycho? Are you a psycho? Get back! 
Oh, you're a pacifist. Okay, oh, well, I'm, I'm sorry. I mean, you just ran up to me out of nowhere, and of course you have a gun on you. I mean, so, uh, you, you do look a bit dangerous, a little bit intimidating. And given the circumstances, you know. What the hell just happened? Oh, oh, okay. So there's brutality, drama, outtake, horror, and uh, erotica. Ugh, okay. So what type of photos do you want me to take of you, Kenty boy? Okay, so I barely got what you said there, but I I'm, I think you want me to take a photo of you and get at least 500 PP points. Is that right? Perfect. Is that the best you can do? Of course you're in the frame, you fucking idiot. Good. Yeah, yeah. Keep it up, old timer. Perfect. Oh, that was kind of nice. Over here, old man. Oh, what? Wait, did I get 500 PP points? I don't think I did. He wanted 500, I think. Perfect. Try a little harder, old timer. Oh, oh, I still have to get 500 PP points. Good. Yeah, yeah. Keep it up, old timer. You do something cool. Perfect. I'll show you for real this time. Perfect. Nice job. <gasps> ah, I missed my chance. So I have to photograph him while he's kicking the shit out of, out of a zombie, right? Oh, come on, Kent. I'm running out of photos here. Ah, perfect. Right on the money. Wait, I got 500 PP points. What do you want from me? Uh, right, I think there is a Photoshop around here. Ah, here we go. Cams, cameras. And there should be what? Oh, batteries. Okay, yeah, that's exactly what I needed. Can't move and let me take a decent shot out of you. Off you, uh, out of you, says I. Jesus, what is with me today? Fantastic. Oh, there we go. Is that the best you can do? You're in frame. Fantastic. Oh. Great shot. Hey, that was a lot of PP points. Okay, cool. So, what do you want me to do now? I got two thousand. What are you on about? Is that the best you can do? Oh, there's Catty. Oh, you did a nice job. Okay, next I'll treat you to my signature cool pose. Get seven hundred PP for my. Oh, good lord! How long is this going to take me? I don't have time to waste on you, Kent. Is that it? Fantastic. Close enough. I'll show you for Fantastic. Perfect. Oh my god, I finally did it. I don't know how I did it, but I did it. Well, it's in focus. And uh, the composition's okay, I suppose. Uh-huh. Hmm. That ain't half bad. Okay, here comes the next one, Frankie. But first... Feast your eyes on my work. Now this is my most emotionally moving shot. <laughs> now this is my sexiest shot. <laughs> uh-huh, uh-huh. Okay, okay. This is my most violent shot. Check it out. Okay, here's the deal, Frankie. You gotta go out there and take even better pictures than the ones I just showed you. You think you can handle that, huh? Yeah.
All right, I think taking better photos than you would be on the very bottom rung of my priority list, to be honest. I'm not in the mood to try and please you, to be honest. Did I say to be honest twice? I probably did. I can't keep track of what I'm saying after time. But, uh, yeah, okay, uh, what I got here? Ooh, katana. Uh, what I replace? What I, can I replace? I can replace the 4x4. Okay, I'm gonna do some serious damage with this. Get away! Fucking slice you and dice you, buddy. Okay, so back up for Brad. That is the priority for the moment. Okay, I got, got a gun, so that's good. Won't use it just yet. And it's still bright out, so I think the convicts don't show up until after dark, and they're psychopaths that have to deal with. Oh, God, Frank, why are you running so slow? I, I mean, that's not even a run. That's, that's barely even a jog. Uh, I wish I had a ca Oh, you can get skateboards in this, I think. And I don't think there's any lying about. You have to get those from a sports shop. God damn, why didn't I think of that? But again, they do take off some uh, inventory space. So, they're not really worth it. Okay, at least I'm not doing too bad on time. That's the main thing. How the hell am I supposed to get past these guys now? Just bait him away with the baseball bat? Okay, that should work. Do it! Make room! I said, make room! Anyone want some more? Oh, oh, oh! Ow, ow, oh, that's it. No more Mr. Knife Rank. Get away! Oh my god, move! Oh, yeah. Finally. Okay, we'll have to talk about this later. You know how to use that gun? I've never fired at a person. All right, I'll cover you from here. You need to stick to the shadows. Try to get close to the target, okay? And what am I supposed to do when I get close? Well, the best solution would be to shoot the guy. But if you can't do that, keep him busy dodging your bullets and stay out of trouble. Are you up to it? I'm a lot better with a camera. But yeah, I'll give it a shot. All right. Next time he reloads, I'll lay down a suppressing fire. I'm counting on you. Make your way over there. One, two, three! Wait, did I just drop my baseball bat? Oh, he gave me a second gun. Okay. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, he said stick to the shadows, but there's hardly any shadows here. Just basically stay out of his line of sight. Oh, this should be easy. Easy peasy boss fight. Okay. I can do this. Or just if you don't fuck off. Me, Otis DeGeneres. Of course, it's gonna be you. Who, who else would be calling me on a freaking walkie-talkie? I don't have time for this. I legit don't have any time for your fortune, Otis. Oh wow, we're taking headshots like a champ. Can 
Can I jump up there and, and make the shots, you know, really count? Oh, he's on the move. Okay, I'm chasing after him. Which is probably going to be a very stupid decision. Oh, he's just ending there. Ow, 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 ow. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, I, I need something to eat. Uh, maybe. <gasps> oh no. uh, burger joint, just gonna be some. No, wait, milkshake, milkshake, yes! Here we go, here we go. Oh, we, we can mix things together? Can we? Uh, okay, put that in there. Oh! I knew this was a thing in Dead Rising 2, but I wasn't sure about it in, in Dead Rising 1. I, I knew we could definitely mix drinks in Dead Rising 2. Quick step. So, this makes me run faster. Oh, it does. Oh, look at me. I'm going like the clappers now. Oh, Carlito. You're in for it now, buddy. Can you hold still? Hold still and let me shoot you, dammit. Here we go. Okay, he's on the move. He's on the move. <gasps> oh! Did he just toss a grenade? He probably did. Oh, and there he goes. Thanks for your help. The name's Brad. I'm Frank West, photojournalist. And right now, I'd rather have an explanation than your thanks, Brad. Sorry. I've got nothing to tell you. Look. I don't know what Jesse told you. But as far as I'm concerned, we're through working together. So you cover your zombie story and leave the rest to us. You, uh, you guys are looking for someone here, aren't you? Hmm? Who is that? Where did you, you take You help it? me, I help you. One hell of a journalist, aren't you, Frank? A hot-headed, underhanded, hotshot paparazzi with nothing better to do than to invade people's privacy. I try. You got a point? You win, Frank. Let's work together. Jesse and I are DHS agents. And yes, we are looking for the man in that picture. You're with Homeland Security. Is that guy a terrorist or something? I took that picture in the entrance plaza. Right near the front door. The entrance plaza. You're sure? Hey! So do I have your permission to cover this story, or not? Uh. Okay, Brad here doesn't give a shit. Yeah. <laughs> Just that. Uh. That's all we needed here. Okay, there's only six bullets in this gun. Might as well waste them on you guys, because I wanted to free up some more inventory space for. 
uh, health food items. I think there's a few more things I can pick up here, or I could get another quick step thingy. Okay, so what do I have? I've uh, I've a handgun, I've a shotgun, and I've a samurai sword and uh, cafe creamer type of thing going on. So what I'll do is I'll make another quick step because that'll make me faster. So the faster I go, the more time I save. Doink, thank you. Now I won't drink that immediately because it's the uh, it's be best to save it as a backup food item or health item. Oh my god, bread is getting clobbered. Oh my god, Brad, what is up with you? Stick up for yourself! Get away! Okay. Wait, do I, do I hear somebody crying? I do indeed, but... Okay, there's two guys in there. So, uh, they're survivors. But I'll worry about them later. Brad can pretty much take care of himself. Oh, more cops here. Zombie cops. Wait, they have guns on them. So I could easily take them off, couldn't I? Oh, he. Oh, the stupid idiot dropped it. Okay, give me that. Give me that. Come, Brad. Anyone there? Oh my god, Brad, will you hurry your black ass up? Excuse me. Ah, okay, so as long as he's in line of sight, he'll follow me. Okay. I assume the same logic applies to survivors I'm escorting. And I skipped a cutscene, but I don't think it mattered. Because we were only opening up that, um, that shutter there. But this one will matter if there is another cutscene. Kindly come with us. We can wrap this whole thing up. No, I'm not leaving until you can Absolutely, guarantee sir. me safe just passage. Just open this these... gate. Just open this gate no. for your protection. This I am not us. opening any gate. Thank you very much. I'm going to stay right Do here. Doctor Barnaby, it's safe. sir. Thank you and good Doctor, goodbye. Doctor Barnaby. Well, what happened? You can't just arrest him. He turned down my offer to protect him. Said he isn't going anywhere until I can guarantee a secure route out of here. Jesse has a direct line to HQ. The first thing we need to do is to call for backup. Okay, temporary agreement. Okay, so as long as it's in the blue. Oh, God, for this. I found a woman in the jewelry shop in the El Frasco Plaza, isn't that where we just wore? Oh, oh, wait. Is that a gas canister? It is a gas canister. Uh, would you. Could you kindly. Fuck off. So if I just shoot that, will everything go boom? Oh, a few things to go boom, yes. And I'm gonna shoot you as well. Boom! Okay, that was nice. That was pretty damn epic, if I do say so myself. Okay, so I'm gonna wrap this video up in the next few minutes. So I'll just save these survivors, go back to the uh, safe house, and uh, that that'll that'll be that. I'll end the video there. So there's uh, three survivors here altogether, I think, because this is the Al Fresca Plaza. Am I right? And this is a jewelry shop. No, it's a clothes shop. The jewelry shop should be down. here. Here, yes, I can hear somebody crying already. Go away. Oh, Leah, that's your name. Um, 
Right. Okay, just have to talk to her. What's the matter? Are you okay? Get back. Jesus. Grace, where's Grace? Oh my god, let me go. Get off. And you know, Frank, I think you're enjoying yourself too much. Oh! Abuse! Grace. What about Grace? Okay, Grace is your baby. Okay, we're making progress. I'll find your baby for you, lady. First, let's get you someplace safe. Just leave me alone. No, 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 no. We're not gonna do that. The, the Aether. Oh, that's terrible. No, 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 no. I can't leave you alone. You're coming with me. Okay, there is has joined you okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to leave first day there and i'll try and jesus christ you're faster than fat zombie oh get back get back so there's two guys in here oh drop my handgun <gasps> get back get back i'm gonna have to try and clear some space here oh my god frank your aim is shit Okay, just eat that at them. Same with this. There you go. And just gonna do some damage. Nice. Now where did my gun go? That's underneath those. I'm not too worried about it now. Okay, so your name is Bert and wait, why are you chasing me? Ow! Ow! Hey, 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 hey! Ow! Stop that. Stop. I said Fucking, oh my god! Knock seven shades of shit out of you! You done? Damn it. Okay, you're the one who started it, not me. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, seeing as you're a bit low on health, I think I can give them health items, can I? Okay, Mr. You, you started beating the shit out of me first. Would you come back here? Follow me. Here. Okay. Eat the cookies. Eat the cookies. Eat the cookies. There you go. And I'll also give Aaron these. You got it. And I'll also give you back your baseball bat. There you go. Thanks. And I'll just blow your brains out like so. Oh my God, no. I missed. So what I have to do? What I have to do with Leia? Leia, who is in here? I, I believe. Me. Okay, there you go. I have to carry you. Come on. Come on. Follow me. And where are those two? Do oh, Jesus! Of course, he won't just shove past them like regular people, no. Oh god, they're stuck in this chair, will you? You, move. Move. And just a good measure. Oh, there you go. Okay, now come on, you've no reason to lag behind now. Come on. So as long as they're w within line of sight, so Aaron, you idiot! Okay, as long as they're in line of sight, they should be able to see where I'm going, right? Okay, there we go. Okay, come on. Wait, is Aaron with us? Thank Where's Aaron? Very much. Aaron's still outside for fuck's sake! Aaron, hurry up, your bitch ass, will you? Here, come on, let's go. I want to get back to the safe house before the freaking convicts show up. Oh my god, Aaron, I will give you a reason to cry if you don't be careful. Frank, you're in the food court now. Yes, Otis, I, 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 I know, I know, Otis, I know, I know, shush. Sweet Otis, my sweet summer child, will you shut up and leave me alone? 
And again, Aaron is just lagging behind there like a freaking son of a bitch. And what are these? What are they doing? Jeez, what is with the AI here? Come on, hurry up. Oh my god. Oh no. Okay, there's... There's too many people here. Get off! There's too many zombies here to deal with. Go over to that corner, you idiots! Where are the convicts? Shit. This is bad. This is bad, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad. And of course, there's this zombie chasing after her. Okay, there we go. Okay, they're the convicts. And I don't have a lot of ammo on me. I mean, I have a decent shotgun. And Sophie looks like she's doing okay for the time being. The convicts, on the other hand, uh, they look like they're a bit uh, stuck. Okay, so I have the upper hand here, I think. Okay, no, not anymore. Oh my god, and good thing they're bad drivers. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. <gasps> So I need to get behind a fat tree. If you could just get stuck in a tree there, thank you. Get okay, to the guy and the machine gun up to worry about, really. Ouchie, 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 ow, ow, ow. She got I should take care of the driver next. Oh. Well, I'll show you some of a bitch. Getting too crowded. Shit. Shit is right. There we go. Oh, I can actually take that shotgun. Or that um, wall mounted gun. Here, now where's Sophie? Sophie's here. Okay, come on, Sophie. Sophie, Sophie, Sophie. Stop running, stop running, stop running. Oh my. Okay, come on, follow me, follow me. Follow me. Will you? Come on. Why are you running over that way, Sophie? So what I'm going to do? Come on, come on, hop in. Wait. Are you honestly not going to hop in here? Oh my god. Okay, so the zombies are big mad. I cut that, uh, I skipped that cutscene out because it's nothing really. It's basically the clock striking 12 and the zombies going nuts. So Sophie can just pod along down that way and I have to go back to Leah. Because Aaron and Bertie aren't going to be any help. Oh, quick step, this is going to be useful. Okay, let's put a bit of pep in my step now. Come here. 
Hasn't really helped me none though um, when picking up Leia. Oh my god, Sophie, just shove him off you, will ya? Thank you very much. Come on. And of course, they won't get into the car, I don't, I don't think. So this has to be done manually, more or less. Oh, good lord, you know what? I'll skip it to when I get to the safe room, because this is just going to be an ordeal. Because there are shortcuts you can take, but they only open up after some time after you've spoken to certain people or saved certain survivors, more or less. I think this is why I, I quit my original Let's Play, actually. Because it was just too much of an ordeal. The going back and forth, having to wait ages upon ages to uh, unlock shortcuts, it just really wasn't that fun. Okay, and Sophie's still lagging behind. Oh god, get away. <gasps> okay, need to clear the crowd. Oh my god, would you hurry up? Okay, that's everyone. Oh. Sweet Christ almighty, that was an ordeal. In fact, I think I'll skip saving some survivors from here on out because that was just way too much work because the AI of those survivors was just absolute horse caca. That's the only way I can put it. Because they're either getting caught up in zombies, not following me, doing their own fecking thing, bumping against each other. <sighs> and here, look, another cutscene. Uh, hmm. Will I let it play out? So that's what Dr. Barnaby said, huh? No, no, I, I'll skip it, I'll skip it. I've been recording for way, way too long. I've been recording for about an hour and 15 minutes. God knows how long this video will be. God damn, it's going to take an eternity to edit. Oh my god. In fact, I think I'll start um, cutting short some cutscenes. In the next video because this it's just getting way too long i mean i thought this video would be maybe about 20 30 minutes i didn't think this game would be as long holy shite in the bag god damn god damn this game god damn the stupid ai will you stop whinging stop whining you're annoying me god jesus christ anyway guys you know what to do if you did enjoy this video be sure to give it a thumbs up comment favorite share and of course subscribe if you wanna and i'll see you in the next one so until next time see ya